Hey y'all, welcome to Freedom Makers, I'm Amanda, and today I just got home from an amazing experience. A local Christian academy had asked me to come in and talk to their kindergarten and first graders about growing food, where seeds come from, um, why it matters, how to grow them. We planted together, so I brought zinnia seeds and marigold seeds, um, and their teachers supplied radish and carrot seeds. And I showed them how to like run their finger through the tray and make a little a little row, sprinkle their seeds in and pinch it closed. And we just sat there in the sunlight and talked about where seeds come from. I opened up um, a zinnia flower so they could see that. We talked about the need for sunlight and water and soil to make the plants grow. We talked about different plants needing different times, different plants needing different environments. We talked about why it matters, why you need to know where your food comes from. Y'all, there is a whole generation out there growing up not knowing where their food comes from. They think it comes out of a box in a grocery store, and I don't know about you, but I think that's pitiful. That is sad. So it's up to us to make sure that the little people in our life know where their food comes from. You never know what your kids are gonna experience in their lives. They may face a challenge in their lives where they have to grow their own food. You never know what the future is gonna bring and if we're not teaching our kids these skills, we are doing them an injustice. So today, I want to inspire and challenge you to get involved in your community. If there's a local school, preschool program, Sunday school, any kind of local environment, your neighbor's kids, buy some seeds, share them with some little people in your life, whether they're your kids and grandkids or not. Our communities need to pull together and stop this crisis of kids not knowing where their food comes from. There is no reason for it. So if you're not doing um, something in your community, if you are not a part of something, I wanna encourage you to start something. In a lot of communities, there's not anything where, where people are um, encouraging kids to, to grow their own food. At our local library, even um, in our community, we have um, been talking about um, doing a summer program so that they can at least see radishes grow. Radishes take like four weeks. There's no reason that kids can't, like in a summer reading program or something, get in there and see food grow. It's imperative our kids know these skills, not just in our local communities, but our worldwide community. I mean, every child should know how to grow some food. So today was just a very surreal experience for me. It was wonderful just to sit in the sunlight and help these kids and talk to them about the importance of food and growing, growing their own. It was amazing. So I hope you found today's video inspirational. I hope that you get involved in your community. And if you do, be sure and take some pictures and share them over on Facebook at Freedom Acres on Facebook. So thank you guys so much for being here. I appreciate each of you and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.